have some serious business to attend to up here. Whoa, that's not gonna work. Who's got one? Who's got a tattoo joint? Just Give it back, dog. Yeah. Is it yours? Whose is this then? Now I have two markers, three markers and a lid I have now. This is awesome. I don't know. Take them off. <laughs> yeah, you guys can fight over these. There we go. Thanks. Okay, now the show can go on.
in Hollywood, I think. And we were all in bed by 11, 20, 12, 20. We're big party animals. Our ideas of fun are uh, arguing about music, flipping through records, talking shit and all that kind of stuff, sports. Actually, I don't think these guys like sports. I like sports. So that's what we like to do. And that's what a straight edge New Year is like. And if you don't like it, well, whatever. I had a great time. I'm having a great time today. Thanks for being here. I don't get New Year's. This year's pretty good so far. Every day could be fucking New Year's. Bring out the fucking party hats and the streamers. So what, I lost my set list. We came, we were gonna do this big thing, we have a set list. I lost mine. Not a fan of set lists. You know, so this song, uh, it's kind of weird on the East Coast. I think hardcore is like a predominantly white hangout. And that's kind of weird. And it doesn't really apply here, but it kind of takes a lot of balls for a black kid or a Spanish kid or whatever to go hang out in a room with 300 white people that are swinging at each other. So uh, I don't think any white people really ever realize that. And I know damn well no white person will go into a room with 300 black dudes that were all kicking each other. So uh, it's just cool to have a mixed up scene because that's one of the things in the world that is probably never going to change is racism and shit. So it's cool that people in the hardcore punk scene don't judge each other. So let's go talk to everyone here. It's called Angle.
Ryan. You were cool. Yo, so it's really cool to jump in an airplane and come real far. Is that a key, a watch? Someone lost their keys? Looks like, uh, looks like they're yours. Uh, it's real cool to come far on an airplane and have people know the words to your songs and stuff. It really means a lot. I'm sure you probably heard some stupid speech like that before, but I'm always, I wrote those words and that's how I feel, so if people agree with me or they enjoy our music, that means a real lot to me and us. You guys want to hear a new song? Well, it doesn't matter because we're going to play one. It's called View of One. It'll be on a record on Triple B real soon. shit about each other, we could have cool hardcore shows forever. Huh? And ever! Forever! Oh yeah, we got it. Yo, so we got uh, three left. And uh, we're playing a couple, we're, not, we're playing some new ones, some old ones. And uh... Oh uh, yeah, okay, so this is another new song. I hope you could understand the words coming out of my mouth. Oh, <laughs> 
got two left. Two, uh, two ones that you might know. So if you know the words, please sing along. I think we're playing uh, the LA area. I don't really know my uh, geography that well. I'm the eighth. Pomona. Yeah, the Latin Junior. So uh, I think that might be kind of a hike. I don't know. But you should all come. Alright, y'all, so we got two left. This is a song I wrote about being straight edge in 2011. It's now 2012, and I'm still straight edge. So are all these guys. And when it's 2012, and I'm cryogenically frozen, uh, I will still be straight edge. And that's, you know, you probably heard people say that before. But I know what beer tastes like. I'm not drinking that shit. I know what, I've fucking seen shit. I've seen crystal meth. I'm not, I, like, I like my teeth the way they are. They're not perfect, but it's what I got. And I don't plan on dipping them in gas or anything. So, pretty much, I see all this shit on the Discovery Channel about straight edge gangs and all this shit. And now my parents, well my parents don't think this, but probably your parents think you're in some type of fucking mafia or something. But you're not. You just try to have a good time on a Friday night and that's not being in the adult baby club and getting drunk and crashing your car and doing all kinds of stupid shit. So this is going out to everybody here that yeah, is straight edge or even more straight edge. I don't give a fuck. If you like hardcore, you're more straight edge than half of the people anyway, so tough for myself. <laughs>